Ubuntu. It's the most popular Linux distro. But a lot of people have been complaining about the new Unity desktop environment. So let's go on our time machine. Back. Time machine's not working. There. Arrow keys have stopped working for some reason. This isn't really a time machine, it's actually a PowerPoint. Um, let's go back a bit further to 3.10. Wow, okay. Whoops, I meant 4.10. 3.10 didn't exist. There we go, 4.10, first ever Ubuntu. Let's check it out. Ubuntu 4.10. Nice loading screen. Come on. Come on. Just a little bit more. Let's clap, clap, clap. And screen crumbling. Okay. Wow, that is the worst start of the downside. Awful. Yeah, it's gone now. Can you turn the startup sound off? I don't know if that was the startup sound or some crazy error. Okay. And it's using the classic GNOME desktop. So, let's see what it has. Applications. I guess that's like the start menu of Ubuntu. Um, what games does it have? Okay. Office. So it uses Open Office, not LibreOffice, like the more modern one. Um, multimedia CD player. That's nice. Play some music. Evolution Mail. Okay. Um, okay, some nice graphics stuff. And what's the accessories? Uh, just standard stuff, calculator, random stuff like that. Okay, what's computer? Ah, oh, so this is like your your folder browser, your home. Here's all your. It's called Warty. Yes, it's because it's Warty Warty folder. Okay. Um. Okay, so I might go down to Office and make a list of tasks I'm going to do with writer writer slash web okay still making those awful noises don't know why that is 1.1 1 .1. I think we're up to like 4 now okay missed the A tasks Four point ten. Doesn't know how to spell its own. I'm sure that's right. Yeah, that's right. I think. Does it have a snap feature? No, there's no snap snap feature. I like my snap feature. Okay. Tasks for Ubuntu. Then I'll capitalize it. Still not saying it's incorrect. Okay. Keeps making bold and underlined in the middle. Make it big, bigger. Twenty would do. Okay. And it's still on huge font. Take it back to twelve. And over there. One. 
doesn't seem to have automatic numbering system. Okay, try that again. Why has it gone back to? No, don't want that. No, it doesn't seem to have an automatic numbering system. Let's see if it has got like a listing system or something. Um, format, maybe. Numbering slash voice. Okay. Okay, what one do I want? Um, no, there's more over here. Just outline. Graphics. Position. Options. I'll go with a graphic one. Uh, like the look of that one. Diamond, green diamonds. Okay. Um, and first task will be write this task list. Task list? What's wrong with task list? Ah, oh, it wants us two separate words. Oh well. And it's automatically done the next diamond green thing for me. Um, actually, I better check out the folder browser. Um, folder browser. And I might do that now. I'll just, what happens if I minimize it? Okay, so it just goes down there. I like the way animation to see helps me see where it goes. Um, where was I going? Ah, oh, computer, home. That's the file browser. It's only got my desktop so far. What if I want to make a documents folder? Where do I go? New create folder. Not new folder. I'm use Windows 8. Um. Documents. Yeah, so now I can save all my documents in there. And, okay, it's a bit like Windows 95, it just opens a new window every time instead of like making a back button. Um, so, if you don't know what I'm talking about, you can check out the Windows 95 video I did. Um, what if I just made a new folder in here because I want to see. I use delete folders, but I don't want to delete my documents folder. File. Um, can you just like press delete on the keyboard? Yes, you can. Can you make a new folder like right by right clicking? Yes, you can. And I like how in Windows it's just like new. You right click and you go down here and it's like new. Whereas this has got create new folder, which is one you're most commonly going to use. And then it's got create document for all the other stuff instead of just having to go to right down here to new out here back up to new folder for whatever and I might save this in my documents folder actually I wonder if control s works it does awesome I'm not making any HTML file Um, uh, open template? No, I don't want to make a template. Okay, I'll save it as a .txt file. Um, uh, what should I call it? Oh, tasks. Okay. And I can exit that. Um, saving in external formats, maybe. No. Well, it didn't give me the option to like make a 
dock or anything. Docky, so whatever. I guess it's not word, but I'm going to create the OS again now. Save, save as. Yep. Well, what other options is it giving me? I can make it as a template or an HTML document, but I don't want to make it as an HTML document. I suppose I could. Okay, I'll save that. But then when it open like Firefox or something, exit that. And, um, I keep thinking of going into applications instead of computer. Um, and it's given me an image file with the diamond thing I'm using as the bullets. Okay. So it can view images. Yay! One of the next tasks. What's this warty with a down arrow? Aha, uh -huh. okay, that's how you like to switch between stuff and go home. More, yep, so it's like the back button, I guess. And here is the text document, pretty boring and plain HTML. And it's not opening. Yes, it's opened in Firefox. Mozilla Firefox. I want it to open it in Open Office. Um, user profile. No, go away. Well, I don't want to open it in <laughs> Firefox. That's why I didn't want to save it in as an HTML document. Opening with text editor. No, I want to open with oh, Open Office. Open Office is a text editor, but I think that's talking about a different text editor. Open with other application. Um, browse. Where would it have? Does it have like a program file? File system? No, I don't know where all these are. I don't know. Okay. What if I just go into Open Office? Um, go open. Um, where is everything? Slash documents. We'll save it in the documents file folder, and I don't know, it doesn't seem to be there. Up one level. Ah, oh, I saved it in Warty apparently. Thought I saved it in documents. Can I move it into documents? Drag? No. No, it only gives me the option to delete, which I don't want to do. Oh well, I'll open this one. Ah, uh -huh. so that worked, but I really want to open it with like my file browser. Um, I want to save it. Save it as. Um, maybe I should save it as like a template or something. I don't know. Uh, or maybe I'm using. Uh, I'm not supposed to be using. Um, writer slash web. Maybe. Oh, now I see it. Open Office Word Processor. Great. And I was using the writer slash web. Which writer sounds like a word processor thing. Uh, obviously not. If I open this one, I'll just minimize it. Copy, Control C. I think that did something. Not sure. Control V. Yes. Now I've got a um word document kind of thing. Uh, I'll just try exiting it, and does it give me the save file? Yes, it does. Good. I like that. If I forget to save it, it'll prompt me. Now, this is what it meant. Open Office 1.0 text document. Great. Now I can save it as tasks. And 
and where do I want it? Oh, uh, it's in documents, so yep. Yep, that's where I want it. Now I can exit it. Fix that. And yes. And now if I go to it from here. Documents. Here it is. Let's put a butterfly on it. Okay. Um I'll just minimize that. Next that. My next task will be to browse the internet. Let's see. I mean, I did have Firefox open before, but actually, I could have just click there. That seems to be like a quick launch thing. Okay. Welcome to Ubuntu Linux 4.10, the Warty Warthog release. Ubuntu is an ancient African word meaning humanity toward two others. Okay. Now let's. See if Google works. Google dot co dot nz. Enter. Just thinking about it. Come on. Yes, Google works, and the ah, even the image works. I think this is supposed to be like black on the top, that's what it usually is, and like chrome or something. But I don't use Firefox, and I'm sure it is in the modern. Actually, yeah, I have used modern version of Firefox, and there's black on the top. So this must just be an older version. Um, I wonder if I could help release notes about this. Version 0 0.9.3. That sounds pretty old. Okay, um, I don't have no idea what the current version is, but that just sounds old. So let's see if the Ubuntu site works. Okay, information you have entered is sent of an unencrypted network and could not be easily and could be easily read by a third party. I don't really care. If someone knows that I'm doing a search for Ubuntu. <laughs> Let's see if it'll run the Ubuntu website. There we go, Ubuntu.com. It's loading. I have got reasonably slow internet, so sorry about this. And, whoa. I thought it looked a bit prettier than this. I think it's full media. Um, it's got like just writing down the side. Okay. Whoa, it's got pictures, yay! And there is the modern version of Ubuntu using the, um, what's it called, desktop environment. The Unity desktop environment. This is using the known desktop environment. Um, Okay. Well, I'm just going to go back to Google. Let's see what else can I see if it works. I'll go see if YouTube works. Come on, I've got that. We do have slow internet, but I didn't know it was this slow. I think it's just the boom to this before this slow. Language questions, okay, goodbye. And, wow. Oh, it's, um, put in. That's why it hasn't gone to the home page. Had Ubuntu typed in. That's why it came up with a whole lot of Ubuntu results. I might see if the home page works first. Oops, your web browser will soon be unsupp will be unsupported soon. Okay. Um get the latest. I wonder if I can upgrade it to like the latest version of Firefox. Does it even will it even run the latest version of Firefox? Actually I quite like Chrome. Should I try and upgrade Firefox or download Chrome? I don't know. Might try both. I'll do Firefox first because that's what it comes screen stored with. 
actually, before I do, I'll just stop this. Um, I might actually just no, I go a no thanks. I'll see if it'll still work, even though it's will soon be unsupported. Where are all the pictures? Got a black line there over there. What is happening? Oh, I don't know. Down. Um. There are no pictures. I this thinks it's still thinking about it. it loads way faster in Chrome. So I know I've got slow internet. But hey, there's pictures, but Chrome still. But I think it's also not only my slow internet, but this version of Firefox or. Maybe it's because it's running in a virtual machine or something, I don't know. Um, but it's got pictures here. Okay. I'll go back up to the top. You need to upgrade your Adobe Flash Player to watch this video. Didn't know I was watching a video, just going on the homepage. Okay, let's try a search. Uh, Going to four point ten. Enter. I uh, pressed enter. It's not doing anything. Search. Search. Here we go. Okay. Yay! It's worked. And one tries out a boon to four point ten. 2004. My favorite YouTube channel, I was first timer, which inspired this. Let's see if it works. Um, changed page in the title bar, but still loading. There we go. Uh, okay. Don't think it's supposed to look like this. We're using an outdated browser which YouTube no longer supports. Okay, I think I'm going to have to upgrade browsers here. I might just. Ah, oh, it's got a Google search thing up here. I didn't notice that before. I'm going to type in Firefox and try and download the latest Firefox browser. And then later I'm. Download. There you go. Then later I might even try and download Chrome. I'm only going to stick with Firefox because it's the default. Um, okay. This, ah, it has got pictures. It's not very graphical. Windows, Mac, Linux. It's probably the most basic version of Mac. Um, alright. What one should I get? Oh, it's like languages here. Okay. Um, I'll get an English one, obviously. Should I get, it doesn't have English New Zealand, I'll, should I get English British, South African, or US? I'll just get the, um, the British one. I don't think that was a very good British, ac British accent there. Um, save to disk, okay. Okay. Downloading. Firefox 25.0. Point, no, dot. Dot bz2. I have no idea what those file extensions are, but I hope Ubuntu knows and can open them. And this might take a while. What's my preferences? Save all files to this folder. Desktop. Okay, that's nice and simple. And what's this do? I think I've got like a show desktop thing down there. Whoa, made a nice noise there. It didn't sound as bad as the startup noise anyway. I think it could get worse than the startup noise. And I like how it's showing me what percent it is complete down in the taskbar. It's a bit like the bar that goes across in Windows 8. Sorry, I keep referring to Windows 8, but it's what I use. Um, okay. Uh, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Yay, where is it? Okay. It said it was going to save it to the desktop. 
Do I just start? Oh, wait, it's got more creepy spots, okay. I, I don't know where it saved it. <sighs> Maybe the Discord, like, needs refreshing or something. I go into Discord with the file browser, doesn't it? No, it says nothing. Oh, don't know what's happening here. Where did it save this? Okay, I'm going to give up on Firefox. I'm going to get my favourite web browser. Chrome. Yes, thinking about it still. Um, okay. Fun. Here we go. Um, okay. Download Chrome. Ah, yeah, it's actually got like what it's supposed to look like, sort of. I don't think, I think that's, I don't think that's supposed to be quite overlapping that much, but it's actually got what the web page actually is actually supposed to look like. And now it's jamming up and this won't work. Okay. It's got what it's supposed to look like, but it's into a jam somehow. Okay, Firefox has crashed. Still crash. Still thinking about it. And this thing isn't even moving around. Like the thing on the mouse move is moving around it. Does this have like a task manager? Aha. It has not res stopped responding. Looks close. Yep. Okay, I'm going to get back into internet. Mozilla Firefox. And now I will try Chrome. Um, okay. Loading things not jamming anymore. Come on. Come on, Firefox. You can do it. Come on. Come on. I'll click on the exit. No, it's still not doing anything. I don't know what's happening here. It says it's loading, but it doesn't seem to be loading anything. But I like this multiple desktop thing, so if I do something over here, let's check it out. It's a multimedia. Hey, it's got a sound recorder. I'm already doing that with my screen recorder. Um. Back in the days of floppy disks. Bug report tool. Firefox isn't loading. Let's go back here. Ah, oh, it's loading the security thing. That's why it took so long. Download Chrome. Okay, I've clicked. And now uh, that stuff going around and it seems to have jammed once again. Doesn't look like Chrome's going to be able to work. Um, so Chrome doesn't work. And now I have to force load it again. Uh, internet. Mozilla Firefox. Why do I keep forgetting to just like use that? I'm going to try and download a later version of Firefox now. I wonder what the last supported version of Firefox that works with Ubuntu 4.10 is. Um, okay. I'll try and s get, find an older version or something. I'm getting really annoyed at how slow this is. Looks like we're using an old version of Firefox. Yes, correct. I am actually. Um, I don't want to start ghosting the next version because it'll probably just crash all the time. Let's try. Uh, but it doesn't have older versions anywhere. Looks like I have to do update the newest version. Update. Okay, update. It's loading. Okay, I'll accept it. Okay. Um, okay, yep. I'm just going to accept it for now. Um, where do you like, actually, like, install it? Um, I can't find where you actually install it. Blah, 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 lots of writing. One more visual. I like the five pictures. Um, I'm going to go installing Firefox. And once again, it's loading for ages. Oh, okay. Install Firefox on Linux. Ubuntu 4.10 to be exact. Um, I don't want the support. Ah, upgrade Firefox is right up here. I, was that up there before? Did I just miss that or something? 
Next one's by design. Thanks for downloading Firefox. Didn't know I was. Okay, new game. Save the desk. Okay, last time that didn't work, but alright. Oh, here it is. I can wonder if I can open this. No, it's not opening. It's not opening. I'm trying to open it. Like the um, show desktop thing down there. Okay, taking a while, I might just go and do something else first. Waiting. Bye. Okay, 20 seconds remaining. Whoa, those are fast seconds. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. Okay, where is it? I, it's supposed to put it on my desktop. What's in the RAM disk? The RAM disk doesn't open. CD RAM. Is that how it opens? Uh, start.execute. Start.execute? I thought the start... I thought executes were like Windows applications. And start was like also a Windows trademark. But let's try. <laughs> display a start dot execute as an error launching the application. Okay. Right. That's like Windows. Yeah. Um still not letting me do this. Um I wanna see my downloads. How do you see your downloads in Firefox? Uh uh no view view downloads. I want to view my downloads. I don't use Firefox. As you can tell. There's probably someone like going just go here, go here, tools. Uh, no help. I want to have some help. How do I view my downloads? It probably sounds a really stupid question, but... <laughs> history? No, I don't want history. I want downloads. Downloads! Where are my downloads? File, preferences... Ah. How can you work offline in an internet browser? I don't know, see what function of that is. No preview, no, no, no. <laughs> this is awkward. Um, my download did give me a preview, but... Uh, okay. I'm just going to Google search. Um, internet for Ubuntu for computing. I need to say internet browsers, but I couldn't be bothered typing in browsers. Um, announcing. Well, that must be pretty old. Um, okay. Unofficial starters guide. Um, uh, wanted an internet browser. Okay, right. Giving me an edit code as well. Great. Uh, maybe I do just type in browser. Yes, I want to send it, okay. And now Firefox has crashed. Okay. 
Another flare pot. Let's see what this mail evolution mail. I don't see how mail's like evolution, but okay. Full name unknown. Okay. I'm just going to type my name. I'm not going to put my full name. Um. Optional information, okay. I don't want to put any optional information. Server type. Microsoft Exchange, I'm guessing that's what Hotmail is, maybe? Exchange server, I don't know. Actually, before I do this, I want to see if, like, Hotmail works in here. Hotmail. In the internet browser, and then I'll try and set it up with evolution mail. Life jacket, okay, help. Um, sign in, yeah, I'll sign in. Still loading. Loading, loading, loading. Look like it almost jammed there. Images, that's pretty fuddy looking image. Yeah. Okay. This is taking ages. I don't know why the internet is so slow. It's not this slow on the way. I know we've got like a slow internet connection. It's not this slow. This is like dial up. Maybe it's because it's incompatible with modern broadcast or something. I don't know. Make this full screen. Maybe. Uh not the input page. You have requested an encrypted page. Well, of course it's encrypted. I don't want people knowing about my emails. Well, I guess you're going to see a few of them because, like, done. Is this all I get? This is done down here. Stop loading. Is this all I get? I can't even, like, type in my username and password or anything. This is, well, that obviously doesn't work. Exit. Exchange server, I don't know what this server is. I have no idea what the exchange server is. I don't know. Hot or something. I don't know. Ford. Okay, check every 10 minutes, that's fine. Global catalog server name? Oh, you don't have to need it because it's allow filters. You message the, um, check me messages. No, I don't want to check the junk. Okay, server. Yep, okay, forward. Time zone. I'm right here. No, I'm not in Auckland. I am in Dunedin. Here. Down here. Right here. There. It's not letting me backspace Auckland. Okay. I guess it, Auckland's pretty much the same as Dunedin, so. Forward. You've successfully applied. Okay. Enter password. Good, it's hiding it, I don't want anyone to know. Oh, okay. Well, that's obviously not how you do it. <laughs> that was a fail. Um. So. browser. Actually, I need to give these like pass and fail and stuff. Well, I want to have like, you know, it's the same problem as Windows 95. Write a task list. I'm going to give that a pass. So. But I want like the pass thing over that way, not the whole thing over that way. 
like that. The whole line just pass thing. So it's like task on this side here. Um, pass or fail on this side here. Which isn't like columns, if you like. But it's giving me the same problem when there's 95 here. Okay, old browser. Well, I'll try and use a space bar, I guess. And then maybe don't put it so far over, because I don't want to hold down the space bar all the time. Caps lock. And. Um. Internet. Realm. Um, well, that worked, I could view basic sites, but I'm pretty sure most people like watching YouTube videos, and it wouldn't let me do that, so I'm going to give that a half. Here we go. And what... What am I supposed to be doing now? Oh yeah. Email. And I need to figure out. Okay, so I found a website here that tells me I need popfree.live.com. So I've entered it here. Board. Um. Yep, I guess so. Sending over some food, so cool. Okay, it's S, yeah, this one, Post. no, I think it's SMTP, dot live, line, live, dot com, I can put this over, okay, yep, so that's it. this one delete yep. wow okay your battery is running low 10 percent yeah i'm emulating this so that's not an ubuntu warning that's a windows 8 warning now i'm back in windows 8 and you can get like start screen stuff whoa Okay, close. Get back here. Actually, my inbox. Inbox. Here we go. Nothing to do with anything. Okay, right. Bye. Um, I'm going to make this full screen. Send receive. Waiting. I'm still waiting. And still waiting. Um. That's taking ages, I don't know why. I think it's because like the first time I've used this and it's like downloading every single email I've got. But um probably good. So goodbye while it's doing that. Okay, um Well, I probably should have taken notice of that um power thing warning. Because my laptop just hibernated. So, yeah. And the mouse integration doesn't work, so I'll disable it. Error while fetching mail. Connection timed out. Right. Let's just try and send some mail. 
want to see if it can send a new um, okay so I'm sending test and let's send in the outbox. So it's still in the outbox. Seems slash is sending one of one. Um, sending message. Sending message. Uh, looks like it's completed. Keeps giving errors. Okay. It says complete with the send thing, it just. I don't know if this worked or not. I guess I will go and check. Okay, we have an OSX update. Let's try mail. Okay, we've got 17, but none of them are from me. So, I won't show the, you them because they're private, but none of them are for me, just believe me. So, it doesn't seem to have worked, unfortunately. Okay, that has not worked. This is weird. Windows 8 taskbar in... Ubuntu 13, no, 4.10. I'm getting confused with the modern version. Anyway, okay. No, it hasn't worked and it's still in the outbox. I thought it said it had sent, but uh, so I don't think it gets passed for. Uh, yeah, I've got. I'm not going to give it a pass for email. I can't get it to work. I've followed the instructions online and I just can't get it to work. So I'm going to give that a fail. First fail. It's going still going pretty good, I guess. But now I'm going to control this there. I'm going to see if I can what sort of games can you play on Ubuntu? Does it hit ambitious? Actually, I wonder if there's a software center. Um, software center, I don't know. Doesn't seem to have a software center. But I guess it was 2004. Newer one's got a software center. I like the software center. So I guess I will be going on Firefox again. Can I change my home page? Do you want to change my home page to Google? How do you change home page in Firefox? Uh, Save pages. No. My home page. Edit. Preferences. That'll be it. Home page. Yep. Da, da, oh, why is it not typing? Um. Bye. Dub dub dub. Dot. Google. Dot co dot nz. Yeah, that one. Okay, now if I click home, Google should work. Maybe. It's thinking about it. Okay, it's worked. Um, games for 
Ubuntu 4.10 No, not 4.10 either. Just 4.10, okay. Um, it's got images, but that looks more like the desktop, and I don't call the desktop a game. Wonder if I just put in um, Linux games. Games for Linux. Okay. Um. Phone's ringing. Sorry, I'll just go and answer that. Okay, what game should I try? Just release. Um, upcoming releases. Just released. Okay. Um, I might try Crusader Kings two. And see if it works. Okay, so it's on Steam. It's transferring data. Waiting. Waiting. Transferring. Waiting. Blah blah blah. I have to buy it now, I want free ones. What happened to my back button? My back button is just not working. It's greyed out, it's greyed out my back button, I don't know why. I'll just go to home. Um. Games. Linuxgames.com, okay. That sounds good. Uh, still taking ages to load. So. Half this video is just going to be the internet loading, pretty much. Yeah. It's pretty sad, actually. Um, and now it's jammed up and I can't scroll down anymore. And it's got a bar down there showing how much it's loaded. That's awesome. I did not notice that bar down there before. So it gives you the loading indication thing up here, not on the optimizer anymore. Up here. And then a loading bar to tell you how much it's loaded down there. And it also tells what you what you're doing, which I like. It says it's transferring data from www. And now it's changed. Okay. I won't read that out then. Waiting, transferring. Connecting, blah blah blah. Okay. What what's its featured games? Let's see. Where does it have its what? No, I don't think that's what I want actually. Um I want free ones. Because I'm not buying ones. I'm not buying games on this. Just to make this video. Seems to. Well. Oh, it's done. That's why. Didn't notice it had done. Free Linux 
Next games database. Okay. It's loading again. This loading is getting annoying. As if it wasn't annoying right from the start. Um, what should I do? Streets of Rage. Wanted memories. Um, I actually tried Wanted Memories. Loading again. No, that was way quicker. Download. Yes, I'll download it. Gamefront.com. It looks like it's in a zip file. That's what the URL says. Okay. Download now. Yep. I'll download it now. See if it works on the 2004 operating system. Oh, I'll open it now. I'll save it. Can I save it? Actually, I might open it because saving it didn't work last time. Okay. Okay, that might take a while, so I'll just go and do something else. So, um, I've got to 99%. It doesn't say 99%, that thing's completely trash. But, if you look here, my phone and my mouse down is completely trash. But, almost done, and my downloader has completely crashed. So, I'm just going to try and download it using Chrome and Windows 8. See how much faster this is. Download page. Um, download the link now. Three, two, one. Um, okay, save. And I'll show you what it's like when it's done transfer it over to Ubuntu. Also, look how much faster Chrome is at downloading. Two point. What does it say? Screen's. The camera's not focusing very well. 2.6 megabytes per second. Um. Firefox are like down kilobytes, so yeah. And I just found out that Haunt has partially downloaded, but if I click on it, an error has occurred because it wouldn't download the last couple of megabytes. So I hope Chrome does better. Almost done. I like how it's got the bubble there, the, like the green line going across in the bubble. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and it's done. Extracting. Okay, so I've got it here, and let's open it up. There. Yeah, no, I'm not sure which one. Well, why is it opening in a zip file? Uh, 
Um, interesting. It's talking about it, maybe. Not doing anything. Try this one. Still not doing anything. Data. Um. Level zero. Using error on tune application. Uh. Just properties. It's an executable. Um, it's not opening. Don't know why. What's this? Can you play the music? That sounds like an awful startup sound. Don't know why this is not working. Okay, this doesn't work. I will um have to give it a fail then. One point one. It's got to the end, but it's not an idea. It just it's blank. Pretty sure I had some, some stuff in it. It's still blank. Oh no, it's got some rulers. Some new typey thing. It's good clock. Okay. I'm going to give that a fail. What should I do now? I'm going to test out the drawing program. Draw something. I'm going to test out the drawing program, might just minimize this. Do that and that. Applications, graphics. For GIMP. I've heard of GIMP, but I haven't actually used it. It's loading. 2.0. No idea what the um, version nowadays is. Starting extensions. It's giving me a tip. Nearly all image corrections are performed by right clicking on the image and don't worry, you can undo most mistakes. Close. Okay, so it looks like it's got all my editing tools in one window and I mean and like my canvas in the other. Oops. I still want to see my editing tools. That one's just a bit bigger. There. So, um, pencil and can I draw it? Why is it not drawing? I'm clicking and dragging, and that's what you usually do, but. Um. Is this not working? Okay. Uh, Art general layers. I'm not 
Oops, let's eat it. Aha. Oh man, that's the bushy bitter. No. No. No, it's the bushy bitter. Just that. Play the fish. My favorite fish. No. Don't know how to draw in this. Help. What's the tip of the day exactly? Next tip. Easy. Um, press an F1 key. F1. Did nothing. Oh no, yes it did. No such file directory. Okay. Well, that doesn't do anything. I'll see what other stuff it has. Graphics. Nature Viewer. Um. Ah. Uh, Need an image editor, not an image gearer. Okay, I'll make this down to here. And I'm not actually going to waste it on this because I don't know how to use this again. So I'll just go to the next task. You. Photos and video. View photo and video. And I prefer to just go and take some photos. And I'll just get a picture of this incredibly old sheet here. The flower. And there's some suburbs looking across an ugly power line destroying the view. Sorry about that. Now insert this SD card. And this is using a webcam so it looks really bad. It's sort of attached to my screen and I can only bend it over. Doesn't really have a good, not in a very good position. But I'll insert that SD card anyway. Yep. Okay, let's see. I've inserted this card. Let's see if it's in discs. Um, try this one. No, that's just my USB with one point one. No, okay. Um, what's this? Um, no, that doesn't work. What's file system? Don't think that's it. DB run. Nope. Okay, it obviously doesn't work with, um, with, uh, with SD cards, so I will Go to my file browser, where is it? Yeah. Um Canon. Don't know why it's called Canon, because I'm using an icon camera, but I guess it used to be a Canon thing. Let's see what they look like. Okay. Let's fix the um That one, that's awful, pretty blurry, whoops, and that one, okay, now I want to, I want that look good as well, shift, copy, and now 
Ja se podím on Nevěře On je On má jen někdy desk Nice Nějaké vanfe Máže na X, je to tady. Kýre, desk. S1. S4, F4. That seems to not work now. Okay. Maybe it needs refreshing or something. Um. What's this thing here? Alright. Okay. Doesn't seem to have worked. So I've reset the virtual machine and it's worked. See? Dot ABI files and dot JPEG. So I'll try and open up both of this. I don't know why it's got footprint logo thing. Not opening either. Open with. Uh, actually, I'll cancel that. I'll go here. Prefix image view. File. Clipping. Um, I think it was this one. No, it's not that one. There. Aha. File not found. How can it not be found? Hang on. I think I know what the trouble might be. Yes, got the USB inserted. Ah. Okay. I think Of that, go back into it, and there's nothing yet. Okay, don't know why it wouldn't open those um, JPG body, I don't know, body files that you have. I think so. Yeah, that didn't work. Okay, so viewing photos and videos I'm going to have to give that a fail sorry Ubuntu and I'm going to say that pretty much concludes it so And now for my full review of Ubuntu 4.10. Um, text editing, yeah, it can definitely be used in 2013. I think Office is fine. And you can actually get it on whatever operating system. And it's free, you can just download it. Um, browser, like browsing files and stuff, yep. Um, internet, definitely as long as you are only looking at very simple websites and don't watch videos in your browser didn't even try and play a flash game or anything um... gaming a little bit of problem for the download 
don't know why. Maybe it's my virtual machine. Um, what else do I do? Photos. No, it doesn't seem to detect my camera device. I um, had it set so that it, the virtual machine was allowed to access my um, USB and stuff, and it still wouldn't work. And when it did finally work, it wouldn't open them. So no, definitely not. But overall, it was pretty good. But I'd prefer to use Windows 8. Bye.